Hello, my dear viewers, welcome to AI Medical School, in this video we are going to study homeostasis, but before starting the video, please subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon. Let's get started. Homeostasis refers to the maintenance of the constant internal environment of the body. The internal environment in the body is the extracellular fluid in which the cells live. It is the fluid outside the cell constantly moving throughout the body. It includes blood, which circulates in the vascular system and fluid present in between the cells called interstitial fluid. ECF contains nutrients, ions and all other substances necessary for the survival of the cells. Normal healthy living of large organisms including human beings depends upon the constant maintenance of internal environment within the physiological limits. If the internal environment deviates beyond the set limits, body suffers from malfunction or dysfunction. Therefore, the ultimate goal of an organism is to have a normal healthy living, which is achieved by the maintenance of internal environment within set limits. The concept of homeostasis forms basis of physiology, because it explains why various physiological functions are to be maintained within a normal range, and in case if any function deviates from this range, how it is brought back to normal. Understanding the concept of homeostasis also forms the basis for clinical diagnostic procedures. For example, increased body temperature beyond the normal range as in the case of fever, indicates that something is wrong in the heat production heat loss mechanism in the body. It induces the physician to go through the diagnostic proceedings and decide about the treatment. For the functioning of homeostatic mechanism, the body must recognize the deviation of any physiological activity from the normal limits. Fortunately, body is provided with appropriate detectors or sensors, which recognize the deviation. These detectors sense the deviation and alert the integrating center. The integrating center immediately sends information to the concerned effectors to either accelerate or inhibit the activity so that the normalcy is restored.